again. Morning, everyone. And we have Nathan back. Nathan Peters, because, you know, he thought he has nothing much to say in 10 <laughs> minutes. You know, we'd go quickly. But you got more to share. For yeah, us. I do. Hey. Yeah. So, and I thought that was just great to hear. You had a healing. Yeah, I did. So, uh, it was last year, uh, sometime. Yeah. Um, I was having a few issues with my back, uh, being a builder and on the tool still, tool still and yeah. Um, yeah. And, and you're almost turning forty. Yeah. 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 So yes. <laughs> <laughs> So you're getting old, and oh, the body yeah. is just reacting. Yeah. Bit. Okay. Yeah. So and it was you were worried about the you know yeah back problem? yeah I was worried and yeah having to give up give up work possibly if my back wasn't able to take it anymore and okay yeah. So how did the healing come about? Um, so I've, I've been a bit well, um, well very aware of healing uh, throughout last year with through our cell group doing um, yeah study on healing. Um, what what so, did you use? Do you remember what what curriculum? Um, uh, but it was a study was, booklet on healing. Was uh, it, yeah, it was it was online uh, videos. Yeah. yeah. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. So you were watching videos on healing together, yeah, and for quite a while. So how did that affect you? How did that play into uh, the healing? Well, we went through a lot of a lot of different scenarios, I suppose, in it, and um, with how healing works and um, the doubts that you have with healing and how to overcome that. And okay. Yeah. Now uh, we're talking a lot about the mind and how the how to get your mind right to, I suppose, and yeah. to have that belief that yeah. you know, that God can. So overcome that rational mindset that, yeah. you know, no, God wouldn't do anything like that. Yeah. So, yeah, that's right. Okay. And then, so you had that and then how did the healing actually? Uh, it was just pretty cruisy sort of <laughs> laid back, I suppose. Like it was at, a, at Living Grace one Sunday morning. Um, I can't remember the exact details of the service, but I, I remember it was sort of just opened up a bit at the end for us just to spend some time, um, just a short amount of time with God, just with some of our worries or something like that it was, and my back was, yeah, was sore, and that was a worry yeah. that I had, and so I just spent a bit of time with God just in the, just in my seat. Yeah, um, so you didn't come forward, just no. where you were? Yeah. And... Uh... and yeah, and I suppose I just believed from that moment that, yeah, God was going to heal my back. Yeah. Yeah. And, yeah, and it had been, yeah, really good. So, so how, long, how long is that? So how many months is it? Um, it's probably, probably been around about a year, I suppose. Year. Yeah. So you had the healing for a year. Yeah. So. But like I've had, the sore back sort of, yeah, it has come Yeah. Um, again, but I've just believed in God's healing again and yeah it, it just goes yeah really so quickly. when 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 it wants to sneak back in you just exercise faith again and yeah it leaves and, it I, and I sort of just say no yeah God has healed me of this and yeah within, so you made yeah. a stand yeah. in faith yeah I'm healed of this yeah how cool is that and yeah it is cool. <laughs> How can you not <laughs> tell me for an entire year? Yeah, like, could only make me tell everyone else though. Yeah. <laughs> oh, so everyone else knows. Uh, no, uh, no, no, no. Then you, then you make me tell everyone oh, else. Oh, yes. Yeah. Which I have done now. Yeah, well, that's on true. Video. But <laughs> it is a good testimony to share. Yeah. Because, I mean, you, you're, you're pretty much... A lot of us are like that, you know, doubtful of healing. Would God really do it? You know, it's all science now. We don't need this. And... So you need a bit of time to overcome this, but now you actually got faith, and you're actually making a stand in faith, yeah. which is amazing. Uh, maybe I just read that one verse. Um, no, it's James five. Um, Is any one of you sick? He should call the elders of the church to pray over him, anoint him with oil in the name of the Lord. None of that happened for you. Yeah. You didn't call the elders. <laughs> there was no oil. You were just, just at God. the end of a service by yourself with God. But here's the verse. And the prayer offered in faith will make the sick person well. The Lord will raise him up. And you, you prayed the prayer of faith. Yeah. And it took a while for that faith to build. 
you know, all the cell group stuff yeah. helped. Yeah, definitely. But yeah, how good is that? Yeah. So. It's good. So thank you, God. <laughs> <laughs> thank you, God. Hey, yeah. maybe that's, maybe that's, do you want to add anything to that? Um, no, it's just, um, like, it's not, it wasn't hard for me to do. Like, it, it probably was a, a process to get to that point. Yes. But, um, yeah. Yeah. It's not hard. No. It was, yeah, it wasn't long. It was just yes. a bit of a yeah, prayer that come from deep down. Yes. Yeah, in my heart and God heard, so. Yes. Yeah. And, like, it wasn't actually you doing it. I think what you did in preparation time, you opened yourself up to the Word of God and His truth. You allowed the Holy Spirit to work on you. And it's actually the Spirit that works faith. You're not just one day, just off your own strength, say, hey, I'm going to have faith for healing <laughs> yeah. now. No, you've you got to saturate yourself with, I guess, the atmosphere, the mm. environment, the truth of God. And, and, but He did generate that faith and you just recognized it yeah. and grabbed it. Yeah, oh, it's in God's timing. <laughs> you, you're going to become a preacher now. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah, thank you for sharing. Thank you for coming in again. And no I hope that's encouraging everyone. I think last time you encouraged everyone to spend maybe 10 minutes in devotion every day. How, how it made a huge difference for you. And, you know, we saturate ourselves with the promises of God that for you as well. May you receive according to your faith. Amen. Amen. Have a nice day. <laughs>